Hi guys, welcome to the Make It Simple YouTube channel. There is good news that the most popular mobile video editor app today, CapCut, can now be used on a PC without the need for an Android emulator program anymore. So in this video, I will discuss how to download and install CapCut on a PC. But before that, please subscribe to this channel first and turn on the notification so you don't miss other interesting information that will come. Okay, first of all, download the CapCut for PC program first. To do that, open Google Chrome. Then go to the official CapCut website, namely CapCut.com. Now after you are on the website, you just need to click this download menu, then the CapCut download process for Windows PCS will automatically run. And here is the CapCut program file after you download it. You can see, the file size is also not too big, only around 340 megabytes. Now to install it is also very easy, just like you usually install other programs. Right click on the CapCut program file and select Run as Administrator. Agree to CapCut's user license and privacy policy. You can also view more to specify the CapCut installation folder and also create shortcuts. Click Install Now. Here just wait for the installation process to finish. And yes, now you have successfully installed CapCut on your PC. And look, it is now on your desktop. Let's open it. Well, this is what the PC version of CapCut looks like. Here you can log in with the account you have first, or not log in it doesn't matter, just start creating. For information, just like on Android, this PC version of CapCut also requires an internet connection. So make sure your PC is connected to a stable internet, so that no problems occur. Okay, this PC version of CapCut has almost all the features in the mobile version such as stock videos, hundreds of music, text menus, stickers, video effects, video transitions, filters, and also adjustments. And well now you have CapCut on your PC, which is certainly not inferior to After Effects. So take advantage of it, to develop your creativity in video editing. I hope this video is useful. Thank you for watching. And see you again in another interesting video tutorial to come.